indeed long time no see so i am here with some cute little vintage barrettes to show you my sunday school teacher from my other church actually asked me if i'd be interested in a box of old barrettes and i said sure and there is some really cute ones in here so i thought maybe i'd share them with you and I don't know if there's anybody interested or not, but I think they're cute. So cute. So this is what I'm doing, sharing these with you. Look at that. Is that not the cutest? Well, I don't know if it's the cutest because I have a lot of cute ones. Hi, two people that are here. Thanks for coming. Look at that. She's like a little Holland girl. Can you see okay? Hope you can see okay and it's focusing okay. And you can hear okay. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh. Is he not cute? I think maybe further away you can see it a little better. Is he not cute? See how old they are? They're probably, what, 50s, 60s, early 60s maybe? So cute! And there's usually, there'll be pairs of these. So, you know, one for each little side of your little head. One for each side of your little heady. Now, I had ones that were kind of, I think I had lambs. And I think these are lambs. Hi, Linda. You can hear me? Nice to see you. These are cute. They're little lambs, too, but I don't... I think... I think mine were different. But that must have been a thing back in the... Well, let me see. What? How old would I have been? I mean, I was probably six in 1906 oh, in 1960, so... I would say they're from like 1960s, very early, something like that, because I would be wearing these probably when I was six or, you know, five or whatever. But you could wear them now. You could wear these any old time you want. If you wanted to rock these today, you might look a little weird, but hey, <laughs> depending on how old you are, but hey, you can wear them. You can wear anything you want to wear, is what I say. And this one's a little... I think there's, there's supposed to be ladybugs on there. Look a little... It's a little worn out looking. And here's little... More Scotties. They must have liked Scotty dogs. This. My Sunday school teacher. She must have loved the Scotty dogs. Because there's another little one where the rhinestone's missing, though. There's another. The pink and blue, I think, was a theme. The pink and blue. Is that like a... What is that? Is that a hobby horse thing? A hobby horse? That's puzzling. It almost looks like one of those little horses that like um, kids ride, but that doesn't look like a kid. That looks like a man. I don't know. I do not know. Here's a big one. Look at this. This is interesting. Big old and look at the back you can tell that's an old clasp old lucite clasp on there it looks like they put it in their mouth to fasten it <laughs> it's got little little teeth marks probably on there let me let me stick it in my mouth till i get my hair up in a bunch and then i'll put it in my hair unless that Unless that made it. Maybe that made the marks on it. 
Thank you for the one thumbs up and the three, all of you, all the big crowd of three watching me. <laughs> the big, the big three, the big three people watching. Thank you. I can hear the crowd now. Woo! <laughs> the crowd in the stands. Here's a cute one. That's uh, it's kind of metallic looking. There's one. We've seen jewelry like this with that type of little prong thing. Look, this is a little merry-go-round flower. Round and round. This one looks uh, not real. It's either just dingy or it's just old. Or both. Could be both. Another little dog. I'll show you some jewelry then too afterwards. I don't think there's a whole lot of there's a lot of plain ones in here, so you don't have to look at all the all the plain ones. The sparkling ones. Oh, that's interesting. That'd be cute for Valentine's Day. Look. A little heart. It's kind of unfortunate their eyes. Their eyes are a little strange, but it's a little heart. Little cupids. And yeah. oh my. Remember these things? Look at Tony Permanent. Tony Perms. Oh, that one's falling apart. Or is that supposed to be like that? I don't think so. Put your hair in those things. Give yourself a permanent. That's a cute one, a little gold one, filigree, a gold filigree one. Roses, needs cleaned. A bow. Some ducks. Isn't that one cute? Oh, That one's adorable. Oh, What's that? Dingy blue bow. These are broke. These are broke. Or broke in. This one. Oh, these little cute birds. The birds. Little fat birds. Another bow. They high five people watching my oh, our our audience just shot up to five. Woo! Here's a a pink one. Another one with the, these two match with the Scotty dogs. These are different. These are all one piece. Like that. Boy, that'd be hard to... Mm, wouldn't you hate to try to get that out of a kid's hair? It's kind of... It's kind of hard to undo that clasp. Oh, that one's cute, did I? I don't know if I had another one like that or not, but that's cute, I like that one. Rhinestone, but one's missing. Here's, a, here's 
another one. You could take one out of there and put it in there. Because there's a whole bunch in there, but some of those are missing too. One of those. One of those. Oh, that's not very good looking. It's this one. Oh, mother of pearl. Huh. It's a nice mother of pearl one. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I could probably sell that. Let's see if there's any mother of pearl of Barrett's on Etsy. I could sell that by itself. Sell all these as a. Oh, wow, this one's old. I remember these. They have a little rubber band. This is for like baby hair. But they used to have like a little rubber band. I, if I pulled that rubber band, I bet it would just break because it's looks like it's so old. But that's the way they fastened them with the rubber band. And then they pulled them over there and they popped it on the edge there. Yeah, that's old. Cool. I remember those. Um, I think the rest of them are kind of ho-hum. I don't see any cute ones. Just some colored ones that are just, you know, just those. So, I hope you enjoyed the vintage baby barrette. I had fun showing them to you. Okay, goodbye. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but I think I will check this one out. It's kind of plain, but I don't know. Just the fact that it's Mother of Pearl on there, inlaid. I like it. I forgot. If I knew, I forgot that was in there. So, so thanks to my Sunday school teacher at my prior church for giving me, gifting me those one Sunday. All right, now how can we get this, how can we get this up so that we can do something else? Okay, now, oh, this is cute, right? Look at this. This is a Colorado, this thing's moving. A Colorado um, scarf. I've been meaning to list it, and I just haven't listed it, but it's really neat. Vintage Colorado scarf. Look at the colors on there. Different things. You can see through it, so it's kind of kind of hard to see but, because the light's shining through it, but. Colorado, it's got some deer on it. It's got, I guess it's got what cities and stuff on it. Isn't that cool? It's silk. Bunch of covered wagons and such. Your cowboy. Neat. I like it. I've had that a long time. <laughs> Too long. That's the way I hold on to stuff. If I if I like something, I'll just hold on to it and look at it forever and a day. Might get sold someday, but that's probably I don't know. Probably not worth a huge amount, but it's still cool. I like old things. Even like the way it is on the edge there. Even though it's kind of it's all worn out, I I like it. <laughs> So, I found this the other day when I was looking at old um, jewelry boxes. It's a Wittenauer watch, and it's 10 karat uh, gold filled, white gold. So, and I, I wound it, and it actually ticks. So I'm like surprised, but it doesn't keep. It doesn't keep good time. It's slow. I mean, it works, but it's slow. Kathleen, how are you? Nice to see you. 
it works, but it's slow. But I did find a, a band for it, so hopefully my husband can put the band on it, and we will see how that goes. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll have to look that up and see if that might sell. I don't know. And I was going back and forth about whether I should list this really great Les Bernard necklace. I love it. I really love it. And it's another thing that, you know, I've had around for a long time. If I list it, it's not going to be cheap. It's good to see you, too. Haven't seen you for a while. I don't think I've seen you for a while. Unless you were live or something and I missed it. So on here is a little hang tag that says, Oh, it jumped up. It jumped up to nine, then it went back to eight. My my people count. <laughs> Little hang tag says Les Bernard Inc. The hang tag is kind of worn. Now it's down to seven. What am I doing wrong? What what's happening? <laughs> Must be my face. Uh where is it? You can't see it. But the hang tag's kind of discolored. Oh, this is the first time you've been able to catch my... Cheyenne, hi! Thank you for coming. Well, I haven't been on very often, so... I always do our walking videos. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I am going to list that. I'm going to list that in my Etsy, so... I'll just pick out some random pieces and show you guys. But these are yeah, clip ones and let's see. I know these don't really sell that great, I don't think, anymore, but this is in such nice shape. I love your videos. They're so relaxing to me. Sometimes I use them. Oh. <laughs> well, thank you. I've heard my voice is relaxing. I, 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 that's a compliment, I guess. I enjoy people that are, are calming, too. I mean... You know, why I listen to um, YouTube if it doesn't make you feel good. Sometimes it's too much. But this is, that looks weird color, but it's not, it's not an olive green color like it looks to me, it looks on there. It's, it's actually kind of a brown, kind of a, man, I don't know, kind of a taupe, a taupeish brown, maybe? But it's a it's marked um, Charel C H A R E L or Charel Charel I don't know but it's one of those thermoset older um, bracelets you can't stay you have to go and pick up a prescription I hope you're not sick but um thank you so much Kathleen for stopping by I appreciate it and be careful when you go. Out there, out and about. I just came back myself from the Dollar Tree. These are um, these are really cute premier design. I know they're fake, but I just think they're pretty still. I don't even know you. I don't even think I would even go so far as to say they're faux turquoise. Hugs to you too, because they don't even look like turquoise to me, but they're pretty. I think they're pretty. So we're supposed to get either 10 or like 12 inches of snow tomorrow. No, wait. Sunday. Tomorrow's Saturday. Sunday. Sunday night and going into Monday. It's supposed to get a big nor'easter. And they're not even calling it a nor'easter. They're calling it a... 
Satsquashian, Satsquash Screamer, or something like that. A Sasquatch Screamer. Oh, okay, Kathleen. See you later. That's crazy. It's even worse than a nor'easter. It's a Sasquatch. It's a little old bracelet. Pearl dangles. Spring ring clasp. Desi, I know. It's 4 o'clock, isn't it, girl? It's 4 o'clock. Come here. Say hi to everybody. All five of them. You want to say hi to five people? There's five people in there. They're just dying to say hello to you. Say, hello, five people. Do you see yourself in there? Look. Look how pretty you are. You're adorable. Are you adorable? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. What's the smell? What's the smell? Is it time to eat? Is it time for you to eat? I know it is. <coughs> she wanted to be on. Not really. I wanted to put her on, so. So I did. Close my chin. I can put on my dog if I want to put on my dog. My dog. These are old Coro clip-on earrings. Fancy. Fancy. Little marked Coro on the back. Take my word for it, they are. Here's some green rhinestone ones. They're marked Gale. I don't think I ever had anything marked Gale before. G A L E. Did you all ever have, all five of you, did you all ever have anything marked Gale? <laughs> this is funny to me. It's no wonder I, no, I'm not going to go there. Here's, here's five. I mean, here's, here's five. I'm crazy. Here's the Gale earrings. Gale earrings. We have baguettes and green I think you call them chat chatons, chatons. I don't know how you say it, but it's a fancy word for some green stones, like green rhinestones. Fancy word. And here's some other green ones. These are marked. Well, it's almost worn off of there. These might be coral also, but I can't tell. Let me look at this one. See what if it looks better. No. Doesn't it? It actually says something on there about those. Glamorous rhinestone jewelry. Ooh. Ooh. These look like they're check. Check. Maybe they're jet or maybe they're some kind of special, you know, check glass with the AB rhinestone. They're pretty cool. I like the way sometimes they have that at the top that looks like your ears might be pierced, but it just goes like that on your earlobe. So that is kind of cool. Seven people. Those. Where's the other one of that? Hmm. It's in here by itself. Oh, there it is. In the front of me. Oh, they're more modern, but they're kind of cool.
Would you be interested in... <laughs> I know that... Maybe if anybody watches this later on, like if any of my subscribers watch this later on, they can, they can leave it in the comments. If they'd be interested, and I know a lot of people, not a lot of people, like, you either like it or you don't, but like wood jewelry. Because I have this, it's like a jewelry jar, kind of, but it's all wood jewelry. So I was thinking of doing a video sometime and just pulling, pulling out the wood jewelry and showing you. I mean, it wouldn't be any big surprise because it's all wood jewelry, but... I don't know if you like cool wood jewelry because there's all different kinds in there. There's pins, there's earrings, there's, um, you know, necklaces and bangles and all different kinds of wood jewelry. But it's like it's a thing where you either you like it or you're like wood jewelry. No, no, that's junk. So I don't know um, which camp you're in. Do we, does he? We don't know. I feel like I showed you these before. I really do. Hope I didn't show you this whole box before. That'd be so embarrassing. I'd be so embarrassed. These are cute. Like lions, wood lions. These are just dangling circles. Dangling circles. They're like matte gold tone. Maybe I should sell those because that's kind of the minimalist kind of things people might want to buy now. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is a, look at this, chunkiness, has a, has a little bottle attached to it, and it's got binoculars, and a book, a book, it opens up, I think, they are chunky charms, aren't they, chunky charm bracelet, should sell that. It's vintage for sure. Why am I not selling that? Why am I not taking pictures of that like today? I wonder if this would go would go better on a necklace. Or leave it on the bracelet. What do you think, six people? These six people are the most special people in the whole world. I thank you for coming. <laughs> this has little rhinestones in it. You sure are quiet people. I'm going to say that about you. You're not a rowdy bunch. You're quiet. I, I appreciate it. You're not out there just being riffraff. Riff You're just being quiet. I don't need any riffraff in here. Let's be <laughs> these are neat. I know I showed these before. At some time or other I did. They're they're made they're made good. They're cool. And they're <laughs> Hey Todd, how are you? They are like recite got a lot of texture on them. They look like bark. Look like something, you know, that was on a tree. Let me just get some bark off of that tree, stick it in a frame, and there you go. Earrings. Mm. Wowza. These are no joke here. These are not a joke. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. I'm serious. I'm not playing the earring game. 
because when I bring it, my earring game, I bring it. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Look at See, I already got earrings on. That's the thing. Oh, I don't get it stuck in there. I get it stuck in my little earring. Mmm. It's high fashion. It's like, you know, it's like um, Fifth Avenue. Or not. Uh-oh, something fell. What was that? My other earring. I don't want to lose that. I'm going to go here and get my other earring. Mm. It fell out. I don't want to lose that because I wear these all the time. I'll show you a few things I just listed. How's that? Or I'm gonna list. I don't think I listed this yet. I'm in the middle of doing my pictures for it. It's a BSK rhinestone bracelet. And it's a stunner. Look at that. Gorge. Gorgy. This. Green ABs. Hi, hi, Desi. I need you. These. I figured maybe somebody goes out for Valentine's Day and they really want to make a statement. And they're statement earrings. They're bringing the. They're bringing it. They're bringing the glam. They wear those. Hey, Desi. Just a classic little heart necklace. Classic vintage heart. These are cool. It's the blue on the one side, red on the other side. Blue, red. You could just confuse everybody and wear a blue one and a red one. I think somebody would like. I told myself I was going to come home from Dollar Tree and list, but I have not made a video in so long, and I just figured everybody was missing me so bad, or not. <laughs> but aren't these cute? They have the fleur de lis, and then they have chains, and they have these uh, ribbed. Uh, balls like the oval though. Aren't they cute? They're really nice uh, vintage and they're in great great shape. I mean they're in perfect shape and they're clip-on. So I think I'm thinking that they would probably sell pretty fast if I get them listed. If I do get them listed I think they're very cute. I have those to list. I have a copper tone eagle necklace to list that could be for a man for Valentine's Day. I don't know who, but hey, it's kind of manish, so I'm like, oh, what the heck? Maybe you never know till you list it. This thing, I think it's got real, real gems on it. Not this, though. This isn't real. That's nice. Are you serious? Or are you just kidding me? <laughs> it's it's kind of neat. And it's uh, kind of old school-ish. So, I don't know. I'll list it. You just never know what people are going to like. So, you have to go and take a chance on, you know, just go ahead and list something. 
What are you doing, Desi? I know it's time to eat. I'll be there in a while, a little while. You like it? You do? If I list it then, maybe you'll buy it. Maybe you'll go in there and buy, shop and buy it. <laughs> I have other stuff like that too I should list then. Maybe, maybe that's a thing now. And what do you think about man brooches? If you were a brooch wearing man, what would you what kind of brooches would you wear? See this this stymies me because I know men wear brooches and I know it's like a fancy a fancy day that you wear a brooch, right? But what what do you wear? I mean I wouldn't think you'd wear a flower. Do you just wear something like the uh, design, um, I don't know, I have a lot of brooches, because I don't miss them very often, but I just wouldn't know how to pick one for a man to wear, and I know it's kind of a thing, but I don't know, that's cool, that's a neat bug brooch, right, but I don't, I don't see a man wearing that. I don't. I don't see a man wearing that. I don't see a man wearing this. I think that... I was going to say that that's um, Sarah, but it's not. It's Jerry's. Jerry's. I don't see that. I know, Desi. Pretty soon, girl. There's a matte finish bracelet. It's soft color gold. Uh, let's see what's in this box. Well, I didn't really, I didn't really show you all the stuff that I was going to list yet. Oh, well, I could see maybe that guys wearing these. I haven't listed them yet either. These are pretty special. These are fish. And I don't know, they're cherry or pumpkin seed fish. They're sun sunfish, but they're a pumpkin seed variety. Uh, um so I don't know if they're trout. I don't know if they have like I don't know. I'm I'm kind of confused about these two. There's There's all these. Now they're real. They're more colorful than they're showing up, I believe. Hey, Cracky. <laughs> How are you? Thanks for coming. But they are. This one's kind of neat. But see, on the back it says. It says 1985 C. Uh, G G maybe Harris fine pewter in pumpkin seed. Now pumpkin seed, I looked up in my book. Good, thank you. I hope you are too. I am fine as frog hairs. That is pretty good. <laughs> I looked it up in my book. This is such a good book. This is the North American Wildlife Book. And you see right here there are sunfishes, right? And one of the varieties is pumpkin seed. Now this one looks kind of like my pen. And this one kind of like my pen. And also in there it says about bluegill and Smallmouth bass and largemouth bass. So I am not sure if they are like bass, if they are sunfishes. I don't know what to call them, but um, they are very cute. Now I can see men wearing those. Definitely, men. That's a man brooch. It could be. I need to get those listed. I have the pictures taken. I just need to get them listed. So they're waiting around for me to finally. Put in my shop. I think I'm gonna make a one listing and um, have have them pick, you know, which one they want, 
I'm not going to do all three. Now what did I do with that other one? Oh, there it is. My favorite one. The red one. That's my favorite one. I can't. It looks better in person. But these have more texture to them. These are more textured. This one's more smooth. So I don't know. I don't know. I like those. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, thanks for putting my hiking channel up there. It's really, I've neglected it. So I need to figure out. And the, the uh, video uh, app that I was using to make my videos, I don't know if they changed it. When I got my new phone, I got a 13, which I should have waited for the 14, but I didn't. And I got a, I got an iPhone 13 Pro. But when I uploaded my Kind or Kind Master, K-I-N-E-M-A-S-T-E-R, was the uh, app that I was using to make videos. Oh, oh, thanks, thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Todd, for subscribing to Moss, Rocks, and Pines, my hiking channel, where we just hike and talk and laugh and see cool things. Um, anyway, when I was trying to uh, do my last upload, uh, I think you have to have the pro version of the app now. So now I have to find a new app in order to make some uh, videos. And that is kind of the case with my um, recorded YouTube uh, videos for this channel, too, I think. Because I used KineMaster, and it's not working for me anymore. So I don't know what they did, what happened. But I have to find another free app. So if you would let me know what you guys use. If you use a free app to make your videos, a man would wear the rope. I missed that, Kathleen. I'm sorry. Something about the rope. Um, colorful. I feel like I showed all this stuff before. I really do. Oh, this is interesting. I learned this from uh, Roberta. Uh, Rose Treasures. I just noticed in her shop she had a piece that was signed like this piece is. And it is Ernst Gideon Beck, made in Forsheim, Germany. So if it looks like a butterfly on the back, apparently they're they're pretty expensive. Because I know hers her listing in her shop, unless she brought it down some, is pretty expensive. Um, I forget what she's asking for hers, but she has a whole set of stuff, I think. But anyway, that's the mark, and the name is Ernst Gideon B.E.K., B is in Baker, B.K., and they're made in Forsheim, Germany. That's probably backwards. That's probably backwards, but there it is. So I didn't know that I had such a thing, but I knew that I had a, a piece of jewelry with that mark on it, so it looks very 80s. I don't have it listed yet. I'll put it in, um, I will put it in my shop someday. I put a nice chain on it. Um, I don't know. I don't know. My goodness, I've been on here 44 minutes. Thank you for all the likes, um, all the thumbs up. I appreciate it. Now, I just feel like I showed you this stuff before. So I don't really want to show it because I don't remember. I can't remember stuff. And I, and, and I would just be, like, mortified if I already showed it. And you'd be like, I like Angie's channel, but she shows the same stuff over and over again. Does she see that? That's weird. Someone was 
by the road, by the sticky tar road that had tar on it, and and it was in the summer, and it was hot tar, and you know those globs of tar, and they put it on these earrings. Or not. <laughs> I think it's garnet. Boy, I'm silly. I am silly today. If you can put up with this, you're really my fans. You're really my fans. Fans. I have fans. <laughs> right. Yeah, right. Banana Republic. Yeah, they're gorgeous. <laughs> like rock candy or something. That, that candy your grandmother used to make at, at Christmas time. And it all stuck together. Like you opened up the tin, and there it is. Only this is in miniature. <laughs> I showed you this. I know I did. Big earrings. Big flower earrings with rhinestones. I have the bulk of earrings, if you don't, if you didn't already notice that. Bulk of my stuff is earrings. Ooh, man brooch. Man brooch. Man brooch? Man pin? Like the key to the city. Yeah, I'm big. I'm Mr. Big Stuff. I got the key to the city. And it has jewels in it. Yeah, that's me. Man brooch. Yeah. Helen Smith. Great to see you well today. This was one of my first day driving since September. Oh! Yay, Helen! You're doing good with your therapy then. I am glad to hear that, Helen. I am so glad that you're doing better. Or Locksmith. Yeah. Locksmith. Hey, it's Mark, though. Sweet Romance USA. It's got a mark on it. So there, it's a it's a designer. It's a special designer pin. So there. And it can be a pendant if you so wish. You can wear it around your neck in your Mr. T necklace. If you wanted to. Oh, these are cool. Sparklies. Recite. Recite with stars in them. Just bought a chain, thick chain from me. Wasn't this kind of length, but hey, maybe. Maybe someone would buy that. This kind of trending stuff. I will put that aside, take some pictures of it, see what happens. These are old. I tried putting these in ketchup, and it worked. It worked, um, but they didn't. They didn't come out as well as I as I wanted them to. So they're still kind of rusty, like. But these are so cool. They're like those. Uh, oh, what do you call them? Um, oh, globes. Um, what do you call those things? I forget. There's a name. There's kind of a name for clear globes. But I forget what it is. But anyway, they're old. Screwbacks. Clear glass. Very old. And they're marked. Uh, what are they marked? They're marked Japan on them. They're kind of. Old looking. Thank you for putting my Etsy store up. That's 
said Etsy Market. That's weird. I don't remember it saying Etsy Market on there. Well, I believe I've been on here 50 minutes. That's a long time. Some people don't like to watch all that long. Maybe they'll just listen to me, go to sleep. But um, Desiree has been patiently waiting. She's just been patiently waiting for her food. Oh, there's one. Don't get your feet in my, my boxes. Are you shy? Are you shy? Are you shy? Hi. It's been a hot minute. Yeah, it's been a hot minute since I've been on, actually. I have to go feed her. She's been waiting for half an hour for her food. She's been patiently waiting. So I gotta go get her her supper time. Right, Dazzy? Supper time? Is it supper time? Is it supper? Huh? What do you want? <laughs> All right, you guys. Thank you so much for coming. And I was kind of silly today, so... Um, I hope it wasn't too silly. Um, I hope you enjoyed what I showed you. And it was nice visiting with everybody. Thank you so much for the thumbs up. And I will see you on the next video, right? I'm not going to leave you in the dust. I'll be back. Just don't know when. <laughs> Take care, Helen. Nice to see you. I'm glad you're driving. Thumbs up, everybody. Bye for now. Have a blessed day. Now, how do I get out?